Hello again. I uh, want to make a short test again about Kaspersky Enhanced Security 2011. Um, have here some fresh links, and uh, software is just updated to the latest signatures. And um, using Critical Pack 2, just for your information, or Critical Fix as Kaspersky calls it. Um, have here some links just for your information Kaspersky now using about 40 megabyte RAM that's quite okay for uh, Internet Security Suite I think so but I will start with the first link here and see how well Kaspersky is uh, detecting this first link possible to download but got blocked um, by Kaspersky and they found a Trojan program inside running the second link I think this link is dead, no it's working but uh, this is blocked by the web antivirus or the URL block blocking feature. They detect this. Oh, actually, they detect this this whole file as a Trojan. Okay, second one blocked. I'm not using any sandbox feature here now, it's just using standard configuration. Uh, third link is blocked. So um, they have this the sandbox as well, which is which is a pretty nice feature and that gives you more more safety because everything you run is in the sandbox is secure cannot infect your system but I will maybe make a video later about this so I have already done this bef when it came out this 2011 Kaspersky 2011 so check one of my earlier videos and you will see how oh, that's a lot of links not working now uh, about one two days old these links they're quite new but um, It's blocked as well. Trojan program. The heuristic Trojan generic. Okay. Um, to remove this, it needs to reboot, quarantine, and reboot the program. So I will do this later. We'll just continue with the next links here this is dead that's blocked URL malicious link And here the malicious link again blocked. That's already dead. Sorry for that. Mm, this is not working or was something where maybe a malware has been posted in the past again malicious link blocked access denied
that's blocked as well um, dangerous object multi generic so uh, this is looks like the heuristic detection of Kaspersky went here and and um, blocked this this malware uh, they don't have a name yet but they but they they um, have some other heuristic signature for it so this this file was blocked while it was trying to execute trying to start to run on the system and again next link is blocked the Trojan program detected so it's pretty good this Kaspersky nothing got through yet and uh, even if it was possible to download oh this is quite big 1.4 megabyte we'll see what's happening uh, when you try to run it we see whether Kaspersky detects this one this is running but it looks like it's still being analyzed by Kaspersky because Kaspersky now uses about 100% of the memory bingo here we go and here we have this application control coming up uh, starting potential dangerous application uh, without signature signature and this application appears appeared less than a week ago and was used by less than 100 participants in the Kaspersky network so now he asked me what do you want do I trust this? Do I restrict this? Allow program execution, blocking dangerous operations only, or blocking application will be blocked and will not be run. So I will use block in this case. So and uh, this this file is then not allowed to run. So uh, this I will show you. We have this. Uh, application control. I made a video about this in the past. Uh, you see here now it, it's classified as uh, untrusted uh, by myself, assigned by you. So, and here we have two other programs which Kaspersky uh, decided itself um, those programs are untrusted and it was not allowed to, to run those files. So that's really um, a lot of technique features behind this program. So we continue with the next link here. And uh, we'll see what's happening here. Okay, that's blocked again. Malicious link. So this is good, even blocking the file before accessing it blocking the, the whole link or the whole domain name. Next file, this is dead. This is still working. But even this is blocked. Um, Trojan program detected. So let's try the last link here. Ah, that link is already dead. Okay. Um, if you check now here, the, the process is running in memory. And nothing suspicious. Um, system looks uh, very clean and um, what more we have here um, yes um, it detect here you see that the malwares it detected malicious URL and suspicious activity inactive activity 
and um, will be moved to quarantine on reboot so now it wants that I am doing a reboot and uh, I will do this now and we will be back when this is finished okay back here Kaspersky uh, started again and uh, we have no active threats right now and uh, we have three threats guaranteed and um, suspicious links and the viruses which Kaspersky detected and also in uh, RAM memory nothing special there I will run just a sc uh, scan here with um, CC cleaner to clean the computer and uh, then running a scan with um, Kaspersky once again to see whether it's detecting anything remaining on the system and we'll be back when this is finished okay uh, scan finished now and uh, Kaspersky found uh, one detection which has been removed I suppose uh, detected there and um, now I will see yeah I will run the scan with uh, my bytes and see how much my bytes will find and we'll be back when when this is finished okay hit my oh uh, no my bytes finished scanning <coughs> and uh, found nothing um, so the system looks really clear a uh, very clean and uh, I will do now a scan with um, Hitman Pro and uh, we'll be back when this is finished okay Hitman Pro finished scanning and only found a tracking cookie so that's fine um, looks like uh, Kaspersky did very well here um, I will run now at the last one it's Norton Power Eraser to scan this as well to see how much this maybe is finding anything <coughs> I don't think it's finding anything but we will see we will back when this scan is finished as well okay um, Norton Power Eraser finished scanning and uh, found nothing either so pretty good Kaspersky blocked everything I used about 15 12 15 active links I think and uh, everything got blocked so uh, pretty good that's about Kaspersky Internet Security 2011 thank you for watching bye bye